vaccine in fact, it is a growing, it is not a real component. We are not going to use a real machine to cut this piece. Instead, we are going to use an imaginary line to cut all our drugs. Now, to do it properly, we need to follow at least three basic rules. They are not only limited to three, there are many. But the most important rules, they are three. And I hope if we can understand these three rules, it will make life much easier for us to answer any question of the sectional rules. Now, we call them the principles of section. Principles of section. <coughs> like I said, here we are going to be guided by these three rules. The first rule is state it states that profile will remain the same. That is the first rule, and we encourage you always when you start with the sectioning. Start with this rule, it will help you a lot. Now, when we talk of the profile rule, we are just referring to the outside of the, of the drug. Now, the rule, as it says, as it states, the profile rule will be said in simple terms, we are just referring to you copy the outside of the drug as given. Always, when you section, start by copying the sheet outside. Then you will be done with the rule number one, then you will go to rule number two. Now the rule number two, it states that insight changes. That is now inside the profile, it must change. When changing inside the profile, we are going to concentrate only on two things. The first one, we will call it the hard line. That is the hard line inside the profile. Now, the rule says now, hard line will just disappear. So, that is what we are going to check. Hard line will disappear. But, with all the exceptions out there, if maybe we are cutting through a support, that hard line is going to remain as a hard line. But when I ask you start, just put this in your mind to say any hard line inside the drawing, it will disappear. But as I said, don't forget that for the A, an exception. If you are cutting through a support, that hard line you must remain as a hard line. Then the second thing inside, we are to do about the hidden line. Now the rule says now, this hidden lines, it will change and it will become hard, hard lines. That is the rule. As long as you can see inside the drawing, inside the profile, somewhere, somehow, there is the hidden line. You must know that that hidden line is going to change and it's going to become hard line. But again, don't forget to for the exception. Exception is when we are not cutting through that hidden line, the rule says that hidden line now will just simply disappear. But if you are cutting through, it will change and it will become a, a hard line. So that will be now the two things which must change, and as a result, it will be now the end of our rule number two. And we go to rule number three. Now, rule number three, your name says, action by using 45 degrees. <clears throat> we are going to section the drawing, we are going to use a 45 degrees set angle. That is according to the rule. But this 45 degrees is not the only. Angle which can be used to 
section with the drawing. We can use somewhere somehow 30 degrees can be used, 60 degrees can be used. But in a classroom situation, we are advised for now. At least now, the angles in which our drawing, the lines are set, it must be at 45 degrees lines. And they will be equally spaced, all these 45 degrees lines. So now, these are now, at least the three rules which you must know. Those, these are the basic rules which any learner must know before you come to the actual drawing. And once again, they are not limited to three, they are even more, but these are the very important ones which it is must know. So now, every time anyone who's searching the drawing must always refer to this rule. So now I will use just a simple sketch to illustrate all these rules here for giving clarity to anyone who would like to perform this activity better. Thank <laughs> you.